Hi guys, this is Ness343 here, and today I'm gonna do another pickups video because I haven't made a video in a long time. Yeah. Okay. So I don't have that many pickups, but felt like I should get a video out. And let's get started. Okay. So first, I got this joystick for the Nintendo. It's called the Star Master. I haven't I haven't even tested this yet, so I'm not even sure if it works. So you got a button on the top, start and select button, another button here. I'm guessing this is B. This is A. And I guess I'll find out. And then the joystick. It doesn't move very far. Uh, I pay five dollars for it at a flea market. Mm -hmm. So, I went to the, um, the thrift store the other day, and I got a Super Nintendo controller, because I actually don't have, like, a normal, I was licensed Super Nintendo controller. I do have, like, some other, like, I have a fighting one, and some third-party ones, but I don't have an actual one. But everything works good, and that's that. Okay, so then when I was at the thrift store, I also got the Super Nintendo games. First got Mario Paint, and I paid $3 for it. I was hoping that I could find a mouse with it, because I know it's worth, worth more with, with the mouse. I actually do already have a copy of this game, though. But hopefully I can find a mouse and sell them or something and next I got NBA Jam Tournament Edition for three dollars for the Super Nintendo I had to have this for Sega Genesis but that was three dollars and I don't have it for Super Nintendo so I got it for the Super Nintendo and um okay and then I went to like the game store that sells old games at the GameStop and I got these two GameCube games I got Namco Museum for $13 a little more than that and it's got Pac-Man Pac-Man um, Arrangement oh, Galaga Galaga Arrangement Galaxian, Pole Position, Pole Position 2, Mrs. Pac-Man, Dig Dug, and Dig Dug Arrangement. I'm guessing that's what it says. It's really small print. So, I got that, and then they both work. Which The other game I got was Midway Arcade Treasures, and that was, I, paid that, I paid $17 for that. It's got... All of these games got Spy Hunter, Defender, Defender 2, Gauntlet, four players. Joust, Joust 2, Paperboy, Rampage, three players. Robotron 2084, Smash TV, Bubbles, Road Blasters, Blaster, Rampart, three players. Sinstar, Super Sprint, three players. Marble Madness, 720, Tubin, Clax, Splat, Satan's Hollow, v Vindicators, and Rupier Tapper. And so I paid seven that's uh, sixteen ninety nine. Those are two GameCube games I got. And they both work, which the discs are all scratched up and they had smudges on them, so I was, I was wondering if they were gonna work or not, but I ended up working. So that's good. And those are the only two GameCube games I have, just because I never had a GameCube, and I was just using Wii. Stuff's fine. And I thought it'd be fun to have a little, like, arcade compilation games. And those, are, that's all I have for pickups. And I know that I haven't made a chameleon twist playthrough thing. But one of these days, I'm going to sit down and just record the whole thing and edit them all so I can upload them. Because 
it'll just be a lot easier that way. And I also haven't done an arcade machine update yet, which is way overdue because the control panel is done now. Um, control panel is done. The whole thing is pretty much put together at the school. But I did take the control panel off for Christmas break because I didn't want to leave it there. So pretty much all that's left is painting it and putting a marquee on it and then bringing it home. So hopefully sometime soon, soon I will be able to come out with Arcade Machine Update and Chameleon Twist playthrough. So that's it, I guess. Thanks for watching. Bye.